and Mikey's dumb answer made the survey. <laughs> to my two people. Be the Jones family now. Oh my. How did that happen? I didn't come off you. Oh, I don't either. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Next game coming up. So even if we don't get the 10 grand in this game, I can't send Mikey over the moon. So he's safe, no matter what. Consider yourself lucky, Batten. <laughs> They're from the Maritimes, and they describe themselves as modern, but mostly deluded. Give it up for family number one. How they describe themselves. They join us from Hartford. Give them a hand. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my. <laughs> Even if Cory were here, I don't think he could send you over the moon for that one. But in the meantime, we're getting underway with game number two. If you saw the previous game, we got the ten grand, so here we go. Top five answers. Looking for the most popular answer? Here we go. Old family, Yeah. Name something that revolves. Something that revolves. Uh, the Earth. Your answer, uh, yeah, the Earth is door. Is it there? Let's see. Does the Earth revolve? It's the number one answer said by 35 people. The Earth. I think we'll play. Louie, we'd like to play. Play? Okay. Family number one is going to play. I think I'm going to be talking about this all weekend. Mikey's dumb answer in game one made a survey. Another player. <laughs> I'm going to say a carousel. Carousel, merry-go-round, said by eight people. Yes, indeed. Good answer. Ah! <laughs> and Louis said, "Good answer." That's better. Yeah, him saying "good answer" has been making me giggle for eleven years. It's something that revolves. A revolving door. Yeah, the door, said by 34 people. So we have the earth, we have door, we have merry-go-round. How about a ball? No? A wheel? Is it that? Nope, strike one. That's strike number one. I know, Louie. Next player, but your dad. Why don't we say... Does the sun revolve? No. Does the moon revolve? The moon, yeah.
Strike two. Uh, the world. Same as Earth. That answer has already been given. How about a globe? Alright. Show me that. Ah, strike three. I can see you added Mr. Apparatusitis Methane to the call, even though he's not on yet. Thanks, family. Another player. Oh, 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 another answer. Alright, what did they say? Something that revolves. They say a washer revolves. Ooh, that's a good one. Good answer. Good answer. Is it up there? Nope, we got it. All right, so we got the first round out of the way. Again, family number one, those points. Let's see what was in four. Number four answer. And a wrap Credit revolves. And what about number five? A Ferris wheel. Oh. Let's check out both families. I should have said Ferris wheel instead of just wheels, so that way I would have gotten the points. But that's okay. We still got the round. Thanks, old meathead Louie. Let's go. It's time for round two. Top six answers for round two. Here we go. Both families ready? Yes. Give a truly relaxing sound. A truly relaxing sound. Uh, the ocean. Your answer, family number one. Okay. Give me the answer. Oh, not there. Number two, you get a chance. What do you think it is, family number two? Birds. Is it there? Show us. Birds is there. Number five said by four people. Good answer. <laughs> Oh, they're going to play. All right. Another player. Okay. Any answer for it? Leave a truly relaxing song. Waterfall. That's a good one. I hope it's up there for you. Bottom of the survey. Said by four people. Meows. Oh, that's a great one. Survey set. But is it on our survey? Whoa, whoa. No. It's not up there. Strike number one. 
another player, okay. Got an answer for us? Give a truly relaxing sound. Rain? Oh, that's a great one. I want to see that answer. Rain is there, so by six people. Good answer! <laughs> A heartbeat. Ooh, good one. I want to see that answer. Uh oh, that's strike number two. Family number one. One more strike and you're up. That's fair. That's go. A truly relaxing sound. Music. Oh, that was my answer. Is it there? Show us. Yep, number two. Clock ticking. Ooh. Okay. Show me the answer. Nope. My turn to steal. Good answer, but it wasn't in our top six. What will it be? How about ocean waves? Let's try ocean waves instead of just ocean. I don't know what's going to be up there. Seven. That's more like it. Ocean waves. Yeah. You got it. My number one answer. Alright, Sammy, number one. You got the points. Who was in third place? Flowing water. Wait, that's the end of round two. Let's look at the score. Okay, it's round three. Let's go. Two more players and we can get going. Let's do it. We surveyed 100 people. Top four answers on the board. Here we go. Ready. Everybody ready? Uh huh. Where do you keep your sunglasses? Where do you keep your sunglasses? Uh, in the car. Your answer, family number one. Let's see if it's up there. Number one answer. Ah. I think we're gonna play. Top of head. All right, show me that. On top of head, it's about eight people. 
Absolutely. Uh, purse? Yep. Good answer. Uh, <laughs> How about bedroom? Nope, truck one. Uh, good guess, but it's not up there. Strike number one. How about shirt pocket? Another player, okay. Got an answer for it? Where do you keep your sunglasses? There we go, we got it. Right. You sure nailed that one. Well done. Thank you. Alright, that's number one. You got the points. Let's check out how both families are doing after round three. Alright, let's. Up to 258 points, so here we go. This is a close game. I guess we'll decide it in the final round. Mm. Round four, points are tripled, but you only get one strike. Then, the other family gets a chance to steal. Let's cut it. more It's there, but two answers are more popular. Good answer. But there's a couple that can beat it. So let's see what our next family says. Okay, family number two. Underdog. Is it there? Show us. I think this time I'm gonna pass the question. Good answer, but it wasn't in that top four. I'm gonna pass. Are you gonna play or pass? All right, family number two is gonna play. Batman, that was my answer. You never know what's going to be up there. Number one answer. Batman. Good answer, number one. Next player, what you got? Jekyll and Hyde? I'm not sure about that one. Alright. Let's see what's on the board. Oh, 
good guess, but no, gotta give you a strike. A chance of steel coming up. with Captain America. Superman had another separate identity. He's another character who has a second identity. No? The Incredible Hulk? You never know what's going to be up there. Send. We got it. You ready for Fast Money, Mikey? Yeah, we're number one. You this is number two. <laughs> what was the last answer on the board, though? Last one. It was... Wonder Woman! That takes us to the end of this round. Let's check the scoreboard. Here we go. Got 492 points this time. Oh, boy, what a game. Congratulations to both players. But, going on to the fast money round is family number one. Who's going to play fast money? All right. Mikey, we got the 10 grand last time. We're going to do it again here? Well, uh, yeah. All right. And you got a dumb answer somewhere in you, don't you? Yeah. All right. Well, let's not waste any more time. Let's get to it. Five questions. Good luck. The clock starts when I finish reading the first one. Question number one. Question is, name a fruit you find in a fruit gift basket. Uh, apple. Good answer. Name an exercise an athlete does every day. Uh, run. All right. Name a fruit with lots of seeds in it. Orange. Name a color in the rainbow. Red. And your last opportunity to give a dumb answer coming up. Let's see what it is. Oh, here's a good one. <laughs> Name something you put whipped cream on. Your ex-wife, on your ex-wife's ass. <laughs> Gosh. All right. All right. <laughs> Let's take a look at your answer. Here we go. Name a fruit you find in a fruit. Fruit you find in a fruit gift basket. You said apples. Survey said thirty-nine. Great answer. An exercise an athlete does every day. You said running. Survey said thirty-three. Fruit with lots of seeds in it. You said an orange. Survey said? 38! You're over 100 already. Sweet. In the color in the rainbow. You said red. Survey said? 36! And something you put whipped cream on. What did you say? And what do you think it got? Exactly. But you got 146 points, so I just have to get 54. I'm ready. Here we go. Name a fruit you find in a fruit gift basket. Uh, bananas. Name an exercise. Uh, 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 weightlifting. Name a fruit. Lots of seeds in it. Uh, watermelon. Color in the rainbow. Uh, blue. We'll put whipped cream on. Uh, a Sunday. No. Uh, how about ice cream Sunday? Uh, 
Okay, I'll say ice cream then. Let's check it out and see how Here we go. Got another 10,000 bucks on the line here. We need 54 points. Find in a fruit gift basket. I said a banana. Survey said... Eight. I think apples was the number one answer. Exercise an athlete does every day. Weight lifting. Survey said... Eight. Wow. Okay. Fruit with lots of seeds in it. I said a watermelon. Survey said... Eight. Oh my! I'm gonna color in the rainbow. I said blue. Da ba dee da ba da. Thirty one. We got it. So ten thousand four hundred ninety two dollars this time around. Now we're at three hundred seventy one thousand six hundred seventy four dollars. And of course, Mikey, I did like your dumb answer, but I did say no matter what happened, I couldn't send you over the moon. So, I still can't send you over the moon, so. And besides, we got the 10 grand, so consider that a bonus.